Hello, I'm Brad Gaddis, the AdWords Workshop Leader and author of Advanced Google AdWords. I wanted to tell you a little bit about myself and the workshop agenda, so you know what to expect. So I've been involved in PPC and digital marketing since the late 90s. Over the years, I've used AdWords as a small business owner, at an agency, in-house, as a Google authorized reseller, and as a consultant. Now over those years, I have worked with or trained a large variety of companies, including Amazon, Google, Microsoft, Encyclopedia Britannica, the World Bank, Oracle, Network Solutions, and many more companies ranging from small mom and pop shops to some of the larger corporations in the world. It's this wide range of experience that lets me see AdWords from many perspectives and can help you get the most out of your AdWords account. Now the goal of the workshop is to interlace basic information and advanced concepts in a way so that beginners aren't lost and can really start to understand how to use AdWords. And yet advanced users can learn tips and tricks to make their management and account analysis much more effective and growing their AdWords account. Now as the foundation of AdWords is keywords, the day will start by us going through positive and negative keyword usage, their match types, research, organization, and so forth to build the foundation of an effective account. Now all keywords do is tell Google when to show an ad based upon a search query. So next we'll examine how to build great ads, how to use dynamic keyword insertion effectively, and how to utilize ad extensions. Ad extensions have become really important with the changes to ad rank. So the best ads are found by testing. So we will cover exactly how to test ads and measure the results for both text and image based ads. Now throughout the day, I'll show an occasional case study so you can learn from how others have performed and we'll discuss some of these case studies and real world data. Now, once we cover ads and keywords, next we'll go to quality score. As quality score is often one of the hardest numbers to work with inside your account, and there have been a lot of changes to ad rank over the past year, we'll examine how quality score is determined, how to find the best places in your account to work on quality scores, and cover strategies for increasing them. Now, the first part of the day covers search, but as the Google Display Network is the largest display network on the planet, we will dive into how to effectively use Google's display network. We'll start by covering the basics of all the targeting methods that exist, and then we'll move into the advanced uses of flexible targeting. Now remember, it's possible to show an ad on the display network only if the user is on a specific site, the article about that site matches your topics, the user is in a certain city, that user has been on your site before, and it's a weekday morning. Now, you rarely use all those conditions at once. However, it's the layering of these multiple targeting options that makes AdWords so powerful for both search and display. We will then move into location targeting. Now, as all users are in certain locations, it's important to understand the best ways to reach searchers based upon their location or their location interests. Now, I often find that national, international, and even e-commerce companies skip over the importance of location targeting. With proper location targeting settings, you can examine conversion rates by area to automatically change your bids. You can use different bidding methods in different locations. You can change your ads by location and a whole lot more. So for location-based companies, this section is a must watch to understand, but it's really useful for national e-commerce companies as well. Now, while AdWords is a great way to bring you traffic with all the proper keywords, ads, and settings. You can get wonderful traffic. However, that traffic won't convert if you have a poor website or a poor landing page. So next we'll examine what pages on your site to send the traffic to, and then layout and conversion ideas that you can utilize to increase your conversion rates. While well, we will stop and discuss concepts and answer questions throughout the entire day, the day will end with an open question and answer period. This is a time that we can really get into how various topics fit together or get into entirely new aspects of AdWords and PPC management. The goal of the day is to help you understand how all the aspects of AdWords works. Get tips on how to analyze the data 
and give you strategies for building and managing your accounts to increase those profits. So I hope to see you at the workshop.